So we all love it. We love going uphill. But once we start to go down, many of us get very nervous. So why is that? So first understand, it's actually very common. So when you're going uphill, we have the added benefits of the incline and gravity to help slow us down, which kind of give us gives us like a, salt, a false sense of confidence and a sense of security, right? So because sometimes a lot of people think, well, I didn't use the brakes or I only touched the brakes a couple times going uphill. Um, maybe I'll have to do the same thing. I'll, I'll have the same experience going downhill. And that's just not the case, right? So once you start going downhill, those extra aids are no longer in effect. So this is the key. While we're going downhill, we need to use the we need to use twice as much brakes, both in pressure and duration, in order to maintain our comfort speed, whatever that may be. Right? So you have to get on the brakes a little bit harder, and you're gonna have to hold those brakes on a little bit longer, probably including the first half of the turn, like using like keeping the brakes on as you tip it in, in order to maintain your comfort speed. So if you're going uphill through a corner at 30 miles per hour, going downhill through the same corner, you're gonna have to hold those brakes down a little bit longer to maintain that 30 miles per hour, even maybe keep that brake light on 70, 80% of the turn. Because if you let go of the brakes, now there's um, the engine braking doesn't come into effect because you have gravity pulling you down the hill. So you're probably gonna have to hold those brakes on longer than what you normally would think. So if you're ready for that and you're prepared for that, then downhill um, is going to give you a problem. And you'll actually end up loving downhill even more than going uphill sometimes because going uphill, you have so much slowing down that you have to, you know, you roll off the throttle and you're slowing down with the engine braking and you're slowing down because of gravity. You kind of have to get back on the throttle just to kind of maintain your speed. But going downhill, once you roll off the throttle, nothing really happens. So it kind of forces you to use the brakes. But if you're used to doing that, then there's not really a big deal, right? Just understand it's very easy to get overwhelmed without using the brakes if you try to go downhill. And no matter what pace you're going, just know downhill twice as much brakes, both pressure and duration. That is the key to downhill success.